Good morning and welcome to the Daily News Show. I'm your host, Robert Evans. And I'm your other host, Seth Luddy. Happy birthday to Tommy Maxwell. And a huge happy birthday to Mr. Jones. Today's lunch will be pleasure your palate. Tomorrow is the last day to buy a yearbook. It's prom week. Tomorrow's theme is blackout. Tickets for prom will be sold during lunch. They cost $20. And now here is Liz with Thursday Trivia. And now for your Thursday Trivia. What is the most expensive home in the world? The answer is Buckingham Palace. Thanks, Liz. Today we honor Clara Wilson for her academic All-State Award in basketball. Congratulations, Claire. April is National Poetry Month, and today is Poem in Your Pocket Day. Here is Nate Breckel to read us a poem and tell us about Poem in Your Pocket Day at Ron Colley Catholic. Every April on Poem in Your Pocket Day, people celebrate by selecting a poem, carrying it around with them, and sharing it with others. Throughout the day, at schools, bookstores, libraries, parks, workplaces, and on social media using the hashtag, hashtag pocket poem. Join us in celebrating Poem in Your Pocket Day this year. There will be pockets with poems around the school. Feel free to take one. And I have a poem for you by Amanda Lovelace. Everyone in your life should be a source of joy. Family, friends, partners. If you always have to worry about them, then it's past time to create some boundaries. Sometimes that will mean getting out some scissors and cutting the very strings that connect you. Thank you, Nate. The word of the day is para, which means an outcast. Another round of cheer tryouts coming soon. Look on the RCHS cheer Instagram page for the date. Here is Thomas Maxwell talking about his favorite memory at RCHS. I would say my favorite memory is seeing Mr. Stofel in the classroom and then in basketball practice and just seeing the vast difference in his personality from being quiet and mild in the classroom and then just, just being fueled with just so much passion on the basketball court. And it's not quite rage, but sometimes it seems like it, but just hearing him yell is something I never thought would happen after having him in class in like the first few months of sophomore year. And yeah. Thanks, Tommy. Today, it's going to be sunny with a high of 73. Games for today, Boys Reserve Baseball versus Ralston at 430. Have a terrific Thursday. Thursday.